Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the LiDAR on the iPhone 14 Pro and the iPhone 14 Pro Max. So first things first, you need to know that other than the iPhone 14 Pro and the iPhone 14 Pro Max, your iPhone 12 Pro, 12 Pro Max, 13 Pro and 13 Pro Max also support this LiDAR. Now, how do you know whether your phone has the LiDAR or not? Well, this black dot you see over here is the LiDAR on my iPhone 14 Pro. Now, before you ask me what does LiDAR stand for and what does it do? Well, LiDAR is an abbreviation and it stands for light detection and ranging. It works by bouncing light waves at the objects and then it detects the time it takes for the light wave to come back so that it can figure out the distance and the shape of the object. It is generally used for 3D modeling of objects. Now with respect to the iPhone, can you enable or disable the LiDAR on your iPhone? The answer to that is no. Then the next question is going to be then what is the use of this LiDAR which is present on my iPhone Pro models? Well, Apple uses this for camera. So your low light pictures are going to be great if your iPhone has a LiDAR. Your portrait shots are going to be great because it can measure the depth. Now other than pictures, another important thing which you can do with your iPhones which are equipped with LiDAR is to measure the height of a person by using the measure app on your iPhone. All you have to do is ask the person to stand against a wall, put the person in the frame from head to toe and in the measure app you will get a pretty accurate measurement of the height of that person. So this specific feature works awesome on your iPhone Pro models which are iPhone 12 and above. Now just because you cannot explicitly enable or disable the LiDAR feature on your Pro iPhones in the camera application does not mean that you cannot use it. Well, there are certain applications which will enhance the capability of your iPhone which you can use to create 3D models that are going to use this LiDAR sensor on your iPhone. One of them is Polycam. So this is going to allow you to scan an object, create a 3D model of it, and then you can import that 3D model into graphics software like Autodesk Maya or even Blender. Another application called canvas this you can use to create 3d model of your house and then once you have the 3d model of your house you can import that into a cad software and then design the floor plan for your house now other than creating 3d models and scanning 3d objects you can also use the lidar app in applications like ikea wherein you can place furniture around your house then you also have your unreal engine which has the reality scan application which also uses the lidar sensor on your iphones and then if you are into racing you have an application called rc club which is an ar racing game wherein it will project cars onto the surface and then you can actually race using those cars which are being projected by this rc club applications and of course most of these applications which we talk about in this video are linked in the description of this video and yes the lidar sensor on your iphone is pretty useful if you are into 3d modeling or you are into ar and vr